Testing, one, two, three, testing, one, two, three. Testing, start with the weight, guys. Yo, what's up? Welcome back to Venkabot Bloodborne Action. My name is David. I'm gonna actually move my, uh, my face cam a bit here. If you guys don't mind, let me actually click this and maneuver myself right around here. Boop. That'll do. How about this? Whoa! Moving right down here. Oops, didn't mean to do that. There we go. Sorry about that, guys. So, um, I sent a Facebook message out, sent a tweet out. I think everything's all set up, right? Let's get in there. Last time we were fighting a uh, boss, I guess. I thought he was going to be more like a mini boss, and I guess he is. He doesn't have a whole lot of health, really, but uh, he is a boss in the sense that he's a fucking boss. All right. This guy's a fucking boss. Hmm. Sorry, I got a little bit of food there between games. Had a lot of fun, a lot of fun playing Fortnite today. Had some fun programming today, too. It's an interesting day. Fridays are always weird on this channel. It t takes me out of my comfort zone because it's a, you know, a different kind of routine than what I'm used to, but it's usually pretty interesting. Okay, cold blood dew. So here's what we know about this boss so far, guys. He will basically kill me in one hit. He has a move up close especially where he does a punch punch real quick, and that will kill me. And he has uh, very low health for a boss. So I have to basically, can I do that to him, do you think? He has very fast recovery on his moves. The Lord of I'm a little bit there. For a, usually bosses have more recovery, like more punish frames. This guy's tip tricky too. I have to be more careful against this guy. I can't spam like I want to. I dodge his attacks. What an interesting trade. I'm interesting I'm being bullshit. Alright, well, I'm still alive. I was just running with him so long. To the boss. Oh, he has a friend, too. I forgot about that. Well, I can skip this guy? No, I really can't. Oh, I kind of can. I just skip them both, really. I actually run past him right now. Okay, that's what you want to do. I probably run past this guy, too, come to think of it. Oh, shit. Oh, he got me. Uh, I think I can skip everybody except for that guy. I was so high up, I don't know if I could hit me. That's bullshit. I call bullshit on that. Yo, this is a really fucking annoyingly long jog to this stupid boss. Let's fucking go. We're just gonna drop down there. Oh, I forgot we gotta do Dark Soul strats, right? We gotta trigger this elevator and then yeah, I'll show you that. Get on here, press the button. Now you do this. There you go. Now let's Okay. It's on the old button. Was it comic not? Souls born. Right. Oh, I can't stun him with that apparently. Okay, let's heal myself. The comic knob. If you didn't know this, we were actually a, a Soulsborne channel for a while. When the channel first got started, my brother down here. When the channel first got started, we streamed only Dark Souls games for a very long time. Probably for like half a year. After that, we kind of branched out to other kinds of genres and stuff. Soulsborne is something we're pretty familiar with. But I hate this game. Okay, so I want to go over here now. Okay, so I have to not get hit by him. I have to punish him very quickly as well. It's another, another trick of this fight. Do I want to just use R1? He's got very low health. That would be the safest option to hit R1. So, you know, I've never played this one, huh? This is my least favorite. I love Demon Souls and Dark Souls and Dark Souls 2 and Dark Souls 3, but I fucking hate Bloodborne. But there's some good stuff. There's some stuff about it that I like, but mostly I hate it. So I don't want to do that to this guy. I have to either do this and run. I think I can't get away with that. It's too slow. I can't cancel it 
And down. I kind of can cancel and dash. Should we try that? Let's try that. Get R2 punish. Two. Three. That's detected basically one shot me. Oh, I swear I dodged that. The camera's so godlike. So I punished him pretty successfully with that R2, right? Just only hit it once. Yeah, I played them all, Comic Not. Played them all, beat them all. Mostly pretty easily. The only thing I had a problem with was this game. That's a big part of why I hate it. I find it hard. Well, it's a, it's a, I, I die a lot. That's why I don't like it. I don't like to die. I hate to die. So kind of I played Dark Souls 1 and 2, huh? I love all the Dark Souls games pretty much evenly. I like Dark Souls 1 a lot. I like Dark Souls 2 a lot. I like 3 a lot. I think 3 is my favorite by a very, very narrow margin. That's a lot of damage, man. These weapons do a lot of fucking damage. Yeah, I think I like Dark Souls 2 more than 1 a little bit, and Dark Souls 3 more than 2 a little bit. And Demon Souls, I'm not exactly sure where that falls. I did love Demon Souls. Alright, uh, I'm thinking R2 for punishes. I gotta just avoid getting hit. We could do the cliche Venkabot, you know, let's not attack him run. Let's try that. Why not? No attacking this time. Only watching. One, two. Oh, shit! That's far range. Okay. Gee, so that running animation is part of its attack. God damn. So when he's running at you like that, it's part of his attack. I thought he was going to run and stop and attack me, but no. It's like a lead up. He runs, 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 and he hits. Christ. Good game design. Yeah, run all the way to the boss. Use a move money you've never seen before. You die. Run all the way to the boss again. Until you've seen all these moves and you have them memorized, right? You gotta memorize them first time. If you don't, you have to hit by them again and die. And hit by them again and die until you have them all figured out. Lord have mercy. How do I, can I fall off this cliff over here? No. Poop. I have to say, the werewolf looks awesome. Makes me hope that for Bloodborne 2 or similar Soulsborne, they allow for gameplay where you can transform like that. It's gonna be Neo 2, dude. Neo 2, well, you can't really transform. It's not fair to say, right? You're saying you like the design of the werewolf. But yeah, Neo 2 is gonna be a mechanic where you transform into a yokai. Similar idea, but yeah, this game does have really cool looking bosses. Oh, can I dodge through that? Look how much damage he just fucking did to me. I just dodged through that, dude. What the fuck? What time is it? How much more time we have in this game? Oh, apples. Oh, comic knot. You are so cruel. Never Apple's favorite game. The game with all the screaming. Screaming bird. You hear that bird screaming? Oh, the prawn they've made. Come on. What's the best way to get down there? I guess right through here. What a stupid fucking combo. God, I hate this fucking game. 
I hate this game. No, 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 what am I doing? I want this other weapon. Here we go. Like this. Any treasure for me? Blood vials, let's go. Such a small arena, dude. So many walls. God, this game's camera is so fucking bad, dude. Like, the thing I'm most scared of in this fight coming up... Like, I wish I could see the boss and then see the attacks coming and dodge them, right? Like, see the attacks coming and dodge them. But the problem is, it's such a small arena, I'm gonna be dodging toward a wall. When you dodge toward a wall, you can't use your camera anymore. I can't see him. Then he could be doing whatever. It's not a big enough place to fight this guy. That's a one-off. Okay. He's got such long limbs. God. He hit me one, two, and I dodged trying to avoid a third attack, and then he delayed it, so he hit me as a punish on my dodge. Ugh. I hate this game so much. I have beaten Dark Souls 1 twice and 3 many times. I've never quit a Dark Souls game without beating it. I don't even think I give a fuck about this game, dude. I'm so fucking salty. Like, why am I wasting my time with this bullshit? We're not even halfway through yet or anything. We have so much more to go. So many more annoying ass bosses to fight. I want to change weapons, change stances. There we go. That was lucky. How am I gonna fight this dude, man? How am I gonna fight him? He kills me. Any anything he hits me with, I die. How am I gonna memorize his fucking patterns? I have to keep running. Every time he touches me, I have to restart the whole fucking map. I have to run all the way over to him. Ugh. Ugh. It's so hard to dodge even one attack from this guy. Let alone enough to survive the whole fight with him. His limbs are so much longer than they look. That's a one-off. Fuck! I lucky as shit there. I cannot see shit! I'm not even sure what the fuck just hit me. I cannot see anything. This would be a hard boss, even if I could see. If there was a big enough arena. If, there, if the arena was twice as big... Then, he'd still be a really, really hard boss.
You're having a lovely night, Comic Knot. Hopefully, it's treating you well. It's a, it's not a boss like a normal boss. But I don't know if mini boss is the right word either. He's just a guy. He's an optional. He's an optional boss. Put it that way. He's an optional boss. He doesn't have a life bar like a boss does. So he's not like a real he's not a real boss. He's kinda of like a regular enemy. Programming wise, he's a regular enemy. He's like a regular foe. He's like a normal ass enemy you'd run into anywhere. He's not like a boss. He doesn't have any special music or anything. Or his own life bar. What Assassin's Creed game is this? Assassin's Creed Halloween USA. God, I hate this game so fucking much. Oh, there's no fucking way that reached me, bro! <sighs> you fuck with a haunted ass range. He has very little health, though, for a boss. <sighs> oh, I thought he couldn't reach me in there. The Werehog. That's funny. He looks like, kind of looks like the Werehog, doesn't he? That's why he reaches so far. Assassin's Souls Creedborn. Ah. <sighs> I really want to start up when that guy's attacks. I'm getting as many blood vials as I can fucking spend. I only have time to spend like one blood vial before he fucking kills me. That's a one-off. Oh, God! No way! No way that reached me! What is with this fucking guy? How do you fucking fight him in an arena that small? How do you... Ah, I'm salty. this game. Can't you shoot it? Uh, not really. Your bullets don't do any damage. The gun is for getting parries, and you can't get parries on bosses. Even if you could, it's a very small window. To get a parry on, a, on some bosses that have little parry windows. Maybe I could parry. Let's just fucking try. Oh, you're still alive. I forgot about that. <sighs> Look at this dude. This is a working werehog, man. Oh, I'm in the wrong stance for a gun. I 
building and stomping against this guy. What's up, Justin? So fight him, dicks. I'm gonna fight him until I beat him or the night's over. Yeah, it's gonna be a long night, guys. If you guys don't want to see me dying in one hit to a boss all night long, you're on the wrong channel. Just send him to the clinic. Okay, that's a one-hit kill. From full health. Approach him with your weapon unequipped, he becomes passive again. Oh, does he? Okay. Because you said to not fight him. No, no, we gotta fight him. Oh, you mean you mean I, you mean I can send him back to the place? Okay. I was gonna use your advice to. Remember your advice yesterday was to get a critical hit on him, a visceral. If it be, if it be passive, I'll do that. You said three charge attacks. Third one, get a visceral. How do you put your weapon away? With your weapon un unequipped. I have to go to my menu and unequip it, huh? Well, I could unequip... I don't know. I could... You mean, like, if I were to... Take off my cane, and then do this. Do I have to put my other gun away too? My pistol? Or if I totally unequip it? Oh, you mean I don't even have to. I don't, know, I don't understand. Okay, I have to unequip it completely. We've got my cane again, then. Vamos, Altair. It's tu momento. It's your time. Hit it from the door with the whip. I could do that, Apples. That'd be cheesing it, though. I want to fight him fair and square. Well, as fair as this game ever gets. I think most people probably just beat him that way by hitting him from the doorway with a whip. What if I try to stay behind him always? Okay, he does that. The trick was to stay behind him. Ugh. Best weapon. It uh, does a lot of damage. Does a lot of damage. Ugh. Probably raise the volume now a little bit. 
So, he only had a couple of attacks that hit behind him. And they were relatively slow to start up. So, basically, all that bitching I did about how far his range was, right, really, really long range, the trick of that was he could only hit somebody with his long range if they're in front of him, right? Basically, he excelled at fighting an opponent who was really far away in front of him. If I'm right behind him, his options are relatively limited. I mean, he still had some pretty badass attacks, but I got, you know, it was much easier to deal with. Ugh. Christ. Thank you, Comic Knot. Thank you for the tips, uh, dicks. I was hoping you'd walk in there with your weapon and get wrecked. Since you killed him anyways, I guess I can tell you that I was lying. <laughs> so you can't, uh, you can't, uh, make him passive again. So, uh, now I can go down that a ways. I got 7,000 souls for that. Jesus Christ, dude. You're breaking my balls. Here's the sub, Ben Cruz. How you doing, man? Seven months in a row. That's very generous, dude. Finally a good game. Man, fuck this game, Ben Cruz. Fuck this game. I'm thinking about quitting this game. I'm hating it so much right now. I was mentioning before, I've never quit a Soulsborne game without beating it. But at this point, I'm hating this game so much, it's like, I already beat the game once. Uh, definitively. Why am I playing it again for? What was I thinking? What was I thinking? Alright. So I can drop down there, looks like. There we go. Fuck this game, dude. There's still this guy still alive down there. There he is right there. Okay, well, where can I go? Where are my options? Go back to Turtles. That's what I'm saying. Turtles was fun. He says, I love hearing you love. I love hearing my ex-girlfriend love. That's why I always hid in the closet. Can you see me? He's just got snakes facing me. That's kind of boring. Alright, so let's see here. Uh... Oh, is he cool? oh he, had a, he had a lantern. I'm about to say, why did the light go out when he died? These snake guys, they got really weird. I probably want to use my, uh, my whip for this, huh? I want to fight them from far away, I think. Two, three, then, oh, that's it, that's where it ends. Maybe it ends optionally. I still lock him with that. That's really good for still knocking foes. The heavy attack with the cane and whip form. Did I not play Dark Souls Remastered? No, comic not. I played uh, the PC version with uh, DS Fix, which is pretty much the same thing, just better. All right, let's see here. So I can go there. I don't know, I'm supposed to go there, right? But where else can I go? Anywhere cool? I never did fall in that trap in the middle of town. Let's go do that. Come here. Bloodborne is his favorite. And B. Is his fave. And B. He won't. He don't play nothing else. I was trying to figure out where Demon Souls places on the list of my favorites. That's what I can't decide on. I only played Demon Souls kind of recently, so I don't know where it places exactly. They're also similar. It's real difficult to rate them. They're all very similar games. Except for this one. I 
Apple's like, hi. So Dick says Dark Souls 2 is his favorite, then Bloodborne, then Dark Souls 3, then Demon Souls, then Dark Souls 1. Easy, huh? Dark Souls 1's combat... I don't know. Dark Souls 1's combat is the worst of the Dark Souls games. I'm not sure how it compares to, for me to Demon Souls. I level Welcome up here. Welcome home. What is it you did? That was his DP, huh? That's your favorite. Very let uh, I can't quite level up. That's kind of funny. Let's go sell something and level up. <laughs> Definitely DP. Fuck beast blood. How do I get more of these? I sold all these already. Found some more, huh? Okay. This strengthens the bullets. Huh? I wonder in what sense they get strength. There's more damage. I got cold blood. Do I should have spent those? Ah, well. Beast roar. <laughs> He makes Nanako watch too. Oh my god. Don't loot Nanako. End cruise. How's your night been, End cruise? How you doing, Home Slice? Alright. Use multiple. Use multiple. No, apples, no. Do not loot Nanako. Come home, good hunter. I was as drunk as fuck, huh? What Had a fun night tonight? Desire? Yeah, Nanako is six years old. Nanako is literally six years old. Very well, let me... Well, Apples, it's very irresponsible of you to immediately sign somebody up for DP without knowing who they are. You gotta get to know somebody before you start telling them they're gonna be involved in a double, penet uh, double penetration situation. Here we go, let's raise that up. I mean, shit, I guess. Cruise is in bed, one eye open, watching best Twitch stream. Oh my god, dude. That's the way to do it, man. You had a good night. Safe in bed. Just hanging out with some friends. Life is good sometimes, dude. It's not always good. But it is sometimes. Dragon Punch is hurt, you pervs. Wow. You, double, you dragon punch a six-year-old kid. Dark Souls 1, PS2 original version, is greater than Dark Souls Remaster. That's a pretty hot take, Comic Knot. That's a pretty hot take. Tell me your, uh, your reasoning. Who you calling a perv? I don't imply anything. That was Venka. This is commentating on Nanako's age. Dragon Puncher playfully, huh? Let's sell items here. I want to buy another level up, please. 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 Level me up, please. I got the can. I forgot I got that. I can still look up here. I got two pairs of hunter's gloves. Fuck that. Two pairs of hunter's trousers. Fuck that. Two pairs of these surgical gloves. Fuck that. Alright. I can sell these, uh... Oh, could you, like, combine these something like that? Maybe you can't, I don't know. These stupid gemstones. Stop being so stupid! Okie dokie. Okie dokie. <laughs> And Cruz had a wet dream and woke up confused. 
My life is a macaroni dream. My life is a macaroni dream in Let little white on, mouses crawl in my bed. What is it? I'm the magic man. Very well, let me. I know karate and definitely used it on a low riding hobbit on Very my well. mountain. Let's go. Oh boy, this is really fucking dumb. What am I doing? This is the dumbest thing I've ever done on the stream. This is more dumb than when I than when I um did that big that night of grinding to get these blades of mercy. So I don't know how, uh, how, but my autocorrect stopped on my phone. Life is so hard right now. Oh, God. What is it? Fucking the modern luxuries, dude. The modern luxuries. Yeah, it doesn't have autocorrect for one night. Now we can't spell shit. It's like when calculators came out and nobody could do math anymore. Very well. Or is that just me? me. Alright, here we go. I think Enkru is too drunk to go to his keyboard settings. Farewell, good hunter. Can I level any of this shit up? No. Uh, yeah, pair that shit. Blood gem fortification. This game doesn't need to have durability. It's so stupid. You don't live in Syria and cruise. What are you talking about? Are you that wasted? You think you live in Syria? Basically, what you need to do is put your phone in a microwave and set it for 23 seconds. Okay. I'm with you so far. What does that accomplish? Interesting. Well, for me, Dark Souls Remaster uh, hasn't uh, relevant changes. It's almost the same game. And the online, online and PC version is some improvements that the mods have done before. Yeah, I agree, Comic Not. I agree. But PS3 version was pretty rough. PS3 version was uh, pretty rough compared to PC with DS fix. Me in the middle, set the microwave for 24.5 uh, seconds, huh? Instead of 26. And Chris says, you're right. But it's okay, I understand you coming down, I understand. is better. Fascinating. Since I'm going to go downstairs, I might as well get a cheese stick. I like the way you think, dude. Mmm, cheese stick. The only difference is uh, better online, less shitty frame rate on console, and slightly better textures on console. If you're on PC, no point in buying it. It's gotta be, it's gotta be better on PC. I, I hope that remaster has got better performance on PC. Than Dark Souls does with DS Fix. If only slightly. Because DS Fix is great and everything, but it's still a challenge to run it at 60. Okay, so let's see. I got everything all done here. Here's a DS Fix works fantastic. Fantastic. There was no challenge for me. Have it here that way. Here, have you feel that way? Here goes. On my PC, I couldn't get it to run at stable sixty. 
And it was definitely, uh, that game is old enough that definitely should have run at stable 60. I had to lock it at 30 so that I wouldn't have it constantly flipping back and forth between 60 and 30. Okay. Ben Woods. Ah, uh, where do I want to go? I go to Old Yarnum. All things aside, though, I bought it for the aforementioned a better online and for active player base. Nice. Don't really regret it, huh? Active player base. Also, you played on Switch, right? Which is cool. I guess I'll go here. I can go to... We can, yeah, I don't want to go to fucking uh, Castle Canehurst. So here it goes. It's going to get on the Switch too. Oh, it never did come out, did it? Isn't that, is it still on the way? I forgot about that. It got delayed or something. Coming in October. It's a pretty good time for it to come out. I bought it on PS4 since most of the people I know have it on their PS4. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna drop down the yeah, I'm gonna drop down the big old hole. That's my goal. To drop down. I'm gonna use my stick. Hey, what's up, dude? Get him with a fucking stick! Get him with a fucking stick. This thing is so much cool in the Blades of Mercy. Why would you use a weeb ass fucking dual daggers when you could literally beat a man with a fucking stick? Not a club. A fucking stick. That's the sickest shit of all time. Forgot about that shit. How the Switch in Argentina is expensive as hell. I'm gonna buy my Switch in November first, and the first two games I'm getting, and uh, the world ends with you and Dark Souls. Yeah, here, lots of us expensive in Argentina for gaming. Get him. It's a stick that becomes a whip. What is more badass than beating a man with a stick and then whipping him? That's sick. Being a man with, ex with explosive fists. That's also good. Oh, how do you fucking know I was there? Does this game have exploding fists? I think I was gonna play some Dark Souls taking a shit. Stay oh, it is in this game. It's Take Driver. I remember that. I only ever used it, though. I wanna fall in a hole, please. It was good! Get stick beaten! You too, dude! What about you? You wanna get stick beaten? Ass wipe? Uh huh. What about you? I feel about sticks. Ugh. Boy, I wish I had a better sound effect, though. The slashing sound is not cutting it. It needs to be like whack! Like whoop! Like damn! Just hit him right in the fucking. Side of the fucking thigh, dude, just as hard as you can. I feel like this thing with the slicing sound is just not doing it justice. The idea of beating a man with a cane. Hey, dude. No. Real scary, asshole. No. No. I can do that too. You guys fucking scared? Am I scary now too? <laughs> Love you. My one is closing. Oh, he's falling asleep. Good night. Good night, uh, end cruise. Away, away. 
so lucky those all hit. It's a hard hit in this game without locking on. Uh oh, right up the butt! Assassin's Resident Creed 4, exactly, Comic like Not. Assassin's Resident Creed 4. Alright, well, let's drop into this fucking hole. Well, that was worth. There's treasure down here. The bum tickler. Yush! Right up the keister. Too much whiskey. Get a good rest, Ancruz. Sleep it off, man. Sleep it off. Oh, there's nothing down here. Just a fucking ladder. Just a bunch of birds. That's your big fucking trap. Oh, I thought this went down to that cave. Okay, well, I guess I'm glad I came down here then. I guess I've explored everything around here to my knowledge. Let's uh, go into the woods, I guess. Oh, I gotta fight my way back now, don't I? It's alright. Hmm, I don't want to fight my way back, though. It's okay. It's probably better that I go like this, then. Because I want a wider attack to fight these dogs. Wow, that was unfortunate. Oh, that's bad. I'll save me some time anyway. I didn't see that guy coming. Through all the oil. Usually I don't mind being oiled up. Usually it's not a terrible thing. But in this game it's usually pretty bad. Okay, so now I want to go to the woods. There's a new enemy type there. Still got my whip. There should be a bonfire down here somewhere, you would think. Thank you, here goes. As a Michigander, it's my god given right. This kind of shirt's my birthright. Fuckers around here, man. Who wants to fucking dance? Hey, look at this. Oh, 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 oh! It's like a, it's like a rat king, but with snakes. Can I stun lock it? Do you think? Uh, probably this form. Very low health. Last minute studying, huh? Dude, let's get a fucking haircut. Michigan is worst Canada, so it works out. Worst Canada, you think so? She bop, she bop, he bop, I bop, they bop, we bop. Okay. 
What is Canada for yours? So yeah, Michigan is very close to Canada. We're just we're just south of Canada here. Michigan and Wisconsin are probably the most like Canada of the states in America, in the United States, that is. It's like Uruguay for us. Maybe. This is a maze. This map, this area is a maze. It's this whole gimmick here. If you stay on the path, though, you can find your way to the exit pretty easily. So, I guess not a maze. But there's a lot of goodies hidden around. If you want to find all the cool stuff, you gotta go off the beaten path. It's kind of hard to find your way back sometimes. Or maybe I'm just stupid. Not only a possibility, but a likelihood. Oh, here's somebody moaning and groaning. Hmm, well, who's doing it? Here goes it's a rebel province. Hmm, a rebel province. God damn. Be the opposite. The U.S. was the rebel province. What if I can still knock those spiders? Of oh, the uh, not spiders, the snakes. With my R1 in the light stance. Can I read this stupid thing, or probably not? Huh? Guess not. So I could drop down there. Uh, no, I don't think I can. But there is winners down there. Yeah, me and here goes are both American. Dix is a Canadian. I don't know if I can still knock them or not. I'm proud to be an American, where at least I know I'm free. And I won't forget the ones that died to give that right to me. Let's look at his stun lock him by attacking him. I see a snake and stew over there. Where's the treasure at, man? Is Florida the worst state? I don't know. Yeah, it's real dark and confusing. That's the whole point of this map. It's dark and confusing. But it's really not that, it's not that bad. It's not as bad as it first seems. Once you realize there's a path going down the middle of it. What is this sound? Something up there. I was born in North Carolina, lived in Tennessee for most of my life, and now I live in Florida. Those are all stinkers. Oh, hi. I'm gonna stick up on this guy. Watch your bum. He still lies in a burn, though. He 
survive the burning. That worked out pretty well. Better than it probably ought to have. Because Hugo lives there. Well, I'm being lured away from where I want to be. Well, that's cool. I like being lured. Okay, let's venture back. Oh, hi. Where'd you come from, dude? One of the sound designers intentionally designed the crackling of dry grass sound effect to be similar to the sound effect of the snakes when they hiss, right? Like a little dry, gla dry, uh, dry grass crunching and shifting. It does kind of sound like snake hissing a little bit. A little bit creepy. where I came from, right? Or no? Mm. Oh, shit! I forgot about those guys with the fucking... Oh, okay. So it looks like Southern Accents, huh? Some Dick's trivia for you. Oh, see, I don't want to go that way. I want to go back this way. This is where I came from. Country roads take me home. I guess somebody fell off a cliff. There's treasure over there. Over here, there isn't a north south since all of two people live in the north. But you guys have kind of like an east west, right, Dix? Because you have, I guess, in Quebec, it's all a bunch of Frenchies. Frenchies and French cheese. Yeah, we do have an east-west. There's a guy up there just growling and being a dick. How do I get up there? Eastern Canada was originally referred to as Upper Canada. Oh, okay. Why? Because it ends up being more northward, huh? I want to get up there and fuck up his life. Make him wish he hadn't been born. Here goes the sad that Jobin doesn't play Ryu in Street Fighter V. I'm not sure who Jobin is. I jump across there, I guess. Generally, the pr uh, the prairie provinces are considered west. It's them versus the east rather than north versus south. Them versus the east, huh? The prairie provinces. Oh, I can drop down here. Oh. It was a really fun replay in 3 4. What was he playing 5? Alright, there's a winner over here. He plays in a collie in five, huh? Yo, there's a winner over here. You can't fool me. I heard him before. Now, how dedicated are you to winning? I have a cane. And I will sound you with it, dude. How many guys are there? 
What in the fuck is that shit? It's Executioner, I think. I don't know if I can backstab these guys or not. No, I don't think I can backstab them. Don't want this weapon or want that. I think I want the blades. I don't want to fight him near the ledge. I want to fight him toward the middle. Let's just fight him. Got me. I try and be sneaky about it, but it just makes more sense to. Ooh, that's a lot of fucking damage. Hunt down Max and Street Fighter 3, huh? I don't think so. I'll let him live. Maximilian Dude playing Street Fighter 3, do you know him? I don't know him personally. I know of him, of course. That would be a fun as fuck stream, huh? I'll let him off easy this time. I think so. I think a lot of streamers try to hunt down Max when he's not when he's uh when he's playing. I think uh, our friend Mutant did that one time on Mutant's stream. He hunted down Max. I played Max once, and he's honestly not very good. I believe it. He plays a lot of fighting games. Third Strike is one of those games you have to spend a lot of time playing it. I feel like he's got a, he plays a lot of variety of games, which is cool too. But I wouldn't be surprised if he's not that strong in 3S in particular. I was mentally fucked because I was too nervous to play on stream. So I lost. No, here goes. It's okay, dude. Wee. Well, that was fun. Losing is just part of being a loser, dude. Well, Dix, uh, Maximilian, dude, he's like a personality. He's a fighting game personality. One of the most popular there is. So there's this idea that he'd be good at every game. He'd be like really good at every game. And he loves Third Strike. So that's why it's like, oh, Max, he's not that good at 3S. It's like, yeah. It'd be surprising to some. He's a fighting game guy. That's the idea behind the bit being pointed out. You would think him being Maximilian Dude, he'd be good at Third Strike. I'm sure he's probably, you know, competent in it. More or less. But he plays so many fighting games, I'm really not surprised he's not good at Third Strike in particular. Yes, he's really more of a personality. Rick's played him in a set. Wow, nice. How'd that go, Bridger? Good. I want my cane back. I love beating guys with a stick. I just love beating guys. I don't remember. You don't remember? How could you not remember? Rip's one of my personal heroes. Was Rick super drunk? Mexi beat Rick like five to three. I like the passion that Max puts into the genre of fighting games. Yeah, me too. He's a pleasure to watch. Max is always fun. I can tell you as a 40 hour week content creator, maintaining a positive outlook is not easy. He has no, I barely put in the effort. But Max, he's always got a positive attitude. Even when you know he's working himself to death. So that's pretty cool, too. I respect Max. Heroes doesn't, doesn't like him all, though. I appreciate the effort he puts in. Yeah, it's not like it was some super serial thing. Super serious type of, type of ordeal. Max versus uh, Rick. I don't watch Max. Because I do find his upbeat... I don't, don't, usually, uh, don't usually like personalities that are always upbeat. Max is always upbeat and he's always hype. But when I do watch him, I'm like, okay, I can see this guy's appeal. He's pretty cool. I have a pro Maximilian stance. Okay. So there's some meany, meany, mean, mean snakes over here that have Hadokens. Max's uh, Dark Souls streams are pretty fun, but his friends are fucking annoying. 
And the fake hype sucks. Hmm. Just hear Jimmy Fallon claims to never fake laugh. That's just how he laughs. How do you feel about that? There's treasure up there. I can see that treasure. And I want it. Okay. That is a winner. Somebody hissed at me. I need my antihistamine. Where's my antihistamine? So there's winners to my left. I might be able to backstab him too. Where did I end up? Have I been here before? I feel like I'm wandering into a situation I don't want to be in. Oh, look, he's got backup. See that? Look, this guy's so sneaky. Maybe I'll backstab before his backup hits me, though. Can I trigger you independently of your master? Nope. <laughs> fucking adorable, man. These snakes are fucking adorable. Get ya. Pierce, I don't believe it to be honest. I believe it though, to be honest. It doesn't stop from being awful though. So here goes not a fan of Jimmy Fallon. I always get Jimmy Fallon and Jimmy Kimmel confused. I think Jimmy Kimmel's way more interesting. When I was a kid, I used to watch a lot of uh, Saturday Night Live and The Man Show, so I don't get them confused. I like Jimmy Kimmel more or less. I, uh, Fallon's okay too, but he's kind of grating. I find him much more offensive than uh, Kimmel. So just Donne, really like either of them. Oh, don't. Okay. I thought you were saying you Donne like them. It's kind of like Dine, right? Oh, yeah, this is a pretty confusing area, I remember now. It's all coming back to me now. Confusing-ass area. It's not as bad as it first seems, though. Okay, we got some winners, though. Like, some actual... Those guys down there are the real thing. Uh, I don't know what their attack pattern is. There's one up here by himself, maybe? I didn't fight him, like, I didn't fight him in isolation first. Before I, before I tried to fight two of them. The only TV I used to watch was superhero cartoons, pro wrestling, and UFC replays. Hi. Oh, fuck, I can be faster than I expected. Jesus. Pretty straightforward. Oh, fuck! Yo, Dark Souls hitboxes. Ah, you son of a bitch! <laughs> Alright, that was actually pretty funny. <laughs> you little fucker. He's got his dad's back, dude. That's what you like to see, right? A family unit. Because they're a true family unit. I almost got the kill there. This little fuck got in my way.
awesome fucking design though. Look at these games graphics, so nice. Apostrophe is to set uh is set to I uh, when it's in CMS mode rather than US. What's CMS? Canadian something system? I didn't watch a real TV show until I was in high school. A real TV show, huh? In Argentina, the TV is only usable for football, football, and more football. I believe it. That football. Canadian multilingual standard. Okay. Football. Well, here we call football soccer. Right? Football is soccer. There's a key combo, and it switches between them. A key combo. I don't know what it is, but I still keep... Uh, you don't know what it is? So you must never use a CMS then, huh? Yeah, American football is a different game. American football is kind of like a rugby. Yeah, I haven't watched TV in a long time either, here goes. I don't know how long it's been. Probably haven't had television service here for more than a decade. I probably have watched TV, do you think, at somebody else's house at some point? Probably my mom's place. She likes TV. Not often. When I, when I need it, I just change it by clicking on the ang button on the Windows bar at the bottom. Okay. I used to do that for Nihongo back in the day. You know, I hear people slithering. Like that one Harry Potter school, what's it called? But I don't see anybody doing it. I used a TV for cartoons, tennis, and other random things. I used to love cartoons when I was a kid, man. I watched a lot of cartoons. A lot of cartoons. Hey there, bud. So fucking adorable. This snake is so cute. Slarthen snake. But now Twitch is like my new TV for me. I like YouTube a lot. YouTube my jam, even though I fucking hate it as a service. Especially as a content creator, oh my god. Like, YouTube is annoying, but when you're trying to make content, it's ten times more annoying. Guys, for the first time ever, last night, I got a uh, subscription feed notification. I'm subscribed to, you know, um, uh, Boundary Break, right? Boundary Break. I got a notification last night that was like, yo, check out this video. I clicked it. There was no video there. It said YouTube Premiere. Premieres in eight hours. What kind of bullshit is that? It's like every fucking day they're trying to make YouTube more annoying. Like, how can we make YouTube more annoying? What can we possibly add to make it more obnoxious? How about YouTube Premiere, where it triggers your subscription feed, but it's, to build, it's like a hype builder, right? It builds hype for the, for the user. It triggers your feed, but it's not actually available. There's a countdown. There's a countdown before it becomes available. Fuck you! I looked at the amount of YouTube I consume a week, and it was like 60 hours a week. That's funny. Most of it is leaving songs on in the background. I haven't listened to music in a very long time. Not, not, that, not that long. It's only a few weeks. The lo-fi music streams. Lo-fi hip-hop beats. Yo. It is noisy. Are you by yourself back there? Oh, hell no! Hell the fuck no, dude! The fuck? Is he aware of me? He's trying to attack me, seems like. This guy wants to fucking kill me. Well, come fucking fight me, asswipe! If you're a god. With a gif of the anime girl writing and flipping a page on loop with giant headphones on, right? Took that with my guy. Giant headphones and giant glasses. Come on, douche. Oh my god. Oh, this is bad. This is real, real bad. That's a slippery slope. 
Ah, oh, these trees! Ah, oh, I got fucking hit by boulders any time. I went through them before. Deserves a Grammy. One hit. It wasn't one hit, it was two hits simultaneously. Big difference. So I got the inner ear itch. Ugh. Alright. We guys had a good week. I'm not gonna be here next week, guys. I might, might be here on Monday. It's gonna be a pretty exciting week for me. I'm gonna be going to TFC. I'm pretty stressed out about it. It's gonna be fun, but it's gonna be stressful too. What's up, Kaiju? How you doing, dude? Keeping together okay today? Just in time for the end of the stream, homie. We're gonna be doing it for probably, probably like 15 more minutes here. Not much longer. That Bible Trump. Who's holding this cane, dude? Use the cane! Lord Johnny says, I'm here from the raid. Let's go. Was there a raid? I didn't get notified. That's frustrating, isn't it? I'm here for the raid, Kaiju. It's one hell of a raid, too, man. What are you playing? You got 11 guys come with you on the raid. That's some loyalty right there. Oh, well, yeah. It's downright fierce tonight, right? So it'll be Street Fighter 2. Figured I'd drop off the crew with you, catch the last couple minutes. Good stuff, Kaiju. Welcome board, guys. Just gotta say, we're just kinda cooling down here. Talk about your bullshit as usual. That's super turbo. Yeah, are you following uh, Undead Kaiju here, guys? Kaiju streams super turbo all the time. Great fucking stream, too. If you like ST, there's no reason not to follow Kaiju. You're insane not to. Making 11 guys come with them. Pretty impressive. I know, right? He dragged them all along. Right, Dix? They all accompanied him. Oh, hi. Those adorable ass snakes, dude. Who would have thought the giant bundle of snakes would be so fucking adorable? Where's the snakes at? Where are the snakes at? Where are the snakes at? You fucker. How dare you. I'm offended, sir. I'm offended. Not enough T-Hawk, huh? We have option select. Join the fights. Who is an amazing uh, Hawk player? O or N Hawk. Oh, hey there, bud. Look at these adorable snakes. I got a lot of. Uh, I can make. I can make my cane stronger now. I got a lot of those bloodstone shards. Hugo's doing his best impression of Audrey Apples. Ooh. Ooh. Grab that booty.
A one, two, three. A one, a two, a three. And a one, a two, a three. Have a good night, Kaiju. Rest well. Don't here goes Balia. Here goes just that kind of guy. Two, three. Good rest, dude. Let's see here. If I follow the path, I'll get my souls eventually. I don't really want my souls that bad. Where the hell is the checkpoint around here? I don't remember. Is there one? There might not be one for a long time. Oh, hi. Let me see you there, dude. Was I here? I know, no. They have really long range. But I wasn't down there. Yeah, let's walk with some restraint. He's gonna see me. So I might as well just go into this stance and fuck him up. Oh shit! Jesus. Oh, what the fuck? I'm gonna get an attack after that. Oh, wow. Guys, I'm gonna call it night there. As usual, if you enjoy it, hang out and keep the channel on and check out my Patreon page, patreon.com slash frankabot. Even a buck is a huge help. Um, you can also help for free by following on Twitch. Tell your friends we're here. Get in the chat. Come say hi. Save clips. They're really cool. Check us out on YouTube at youtube.com slash archive. Go watch me beat this game on YouTube right now from start to finish. So I don't have to beat it again. Um, we also have Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3 in Neo. We've got other retro games, RPGs, modern games, horror games, shooting games, online stuff like Fortnite Battle Royale, GTA Online, MapleStory, RuneScape, whatever you want, man. It's a huge variety. About a thousand videos on YouTube right now. Just go ahead and search for ThinkBot Online. You'll find me. Um, I might not be here next week, guys. I'm probably going to be here on Monday. Probably. And then that might only that might be it. Just Monday. It's going to be uh, um, TFC next week. I have to get prepared and drive for two days. And uh, it's going to be a lot of fun once I'm there, but I'm kind of stressed out about the drive, especially. Um, then I'm going to be back uh, the following Wednesday. I'm going to be gone all next week after Monday. And then probably be back the following Wednesday or something like that. I'll let you guys know on the Discord channel. I will uh, see you guys when I see you guys. Um, until then, have a nice weekend. Let me see here. I need to kick off my... Uh, my slipper so I can feel around on my little footboard where my button is. Oh, where is it? Where is it? There it is. That's the one. That's the one. Good night, Comic Knot. Buenos noches, Comic Knot. Because you're going to drive down with pals, right? Uh, well, I don't know these guys. Here you go. I don't know these guys at all. I know them, you know, as guys I've met in tournaments before. Have a good night, Dick. It's always a pleasure having you, man. Good night, here goes.
change at day night cycle, and you can change it at will to night in Vicar's uh, Bostrom. Really? Go ahead, Berdrinka. I didn't even know it was a day night cycle. Get a good rest, dude. Outside at last, Lord Johnny, breathing the fresh air, dude. Always happy to have you, Comic Knot. Oh, fuck! It's already night, isn't it? Uh, yeah, there's the moon, so usually that's a pretty good indicator that it's nighttime. Adios! Like it was daytime earlier. I assumed it was based on where I was at. Adios, amigo! Since you can interact with the Lawrence's skull, it becomes night. This is an open area, right? But, I don't know, the way the giant bosses move around it makes it very hard to not get put against a wall. I feel like Dark Souls doesn't have this problem to the same extent. Oh, come the fuck on! Damn, this game is godly. 